So what is up everyone this is Kiran here welcome back to Tech Kiran YouTube channel new update for the Poco X3 Indian users it's now available which is MIUI 12.0.10.0 stable version it's still based on Android version 10 sometime ago I made a video on Poco X3 new update which is based on Android version 11 that was official update and the thing was that was the EEA Europe stable that was kind of a global stable not Indian stable but Indian users now got this latest update according to the changelog we have the latest security patch of April 2021 which is actually good because other devices didn't got April 2021 most of the devices I have the example of Redmi Note 9 Pro and this one is based on Android version 10 the thing is it's not based on Android version 11 so the things you saw in the Android version 11 update video are currently not present in this update let me show you that this is based on Android version 10 it's not based on Android version 11 in Android version 11 you got the new pill option there the new swiping gestures new floating windows related things but those things will not be available in this build unfortunately I have applied the custom icon pack here but let me show you this kind of options swiping down from the right side swiping down from the left side doesn't even matter you will only get the notification panel you will not get the control center and this was the thing which is changed in the android version 11 global stable update but indian users will not get this update right now they got this latest update with the april security patch and MIUI 12.0.10.0 and the thing is it's actually good kind of update and it's available as an OTA update. You don't need any kind of custom recovery, you don't need any kind of bootloader unlock. You can install this update via OTA or you can install this update via recovery also. It's just up to you. This update is available for almost every user right now. The thing is the smoothness is still good here and also I have applied animations at 0.5x. I always use 0.5x, I don't like 1x animation so don't complain like that. You can also use 0.5x, that's quite far better. In this update, as expectedly, we have the global dialer pad which is Google dialer pad. Google messages app are present there. So thing is, but still the get apps option is there. You can update the system apps directly from this. Theme store has all the customization options present. For example, the status bar related customization lock screen related customizations we have the boot audio we have the icons favorite stray boot animation all these options are present in the theme store which you can customize separately if you're looking for it and it's a kind of good thing but the thing is it is indian theme it is actually indian theme store global theme store so you'll not get the import option if you don't know how to get an import option you can get the import option basically and how you can get that import option i made a specific dedicated video on that topic make sure to check out that and you will be able to import themes in your global room in your global indian theme indian update room but the thing is for that it requires root but if you don't want root don't use third party themes of course let me show you this full screen display the thing which was added in the android version 11 update is not present in this android 10 update as you can see the full screen new gestures are not present there the new navigation bar pill is not present there floating windows is not able to view here as you can see everything is same like the previous update only the security patch is changed but if you compare it with the latest android 11 global stable update there are few more changes as you can see no navigation bar pill no swiping gestures no full screen gestures and even though no floating windows so this might be a disappointing thing but the thing is maybe the next update you might get based on miui 12.5 or you will get the android 11 update first and then miui 12.5 update later on it's just just not an idea it's not a it's actually not sure this might be the thing this might not be the thing it's not confirmed here honestly let me show you some other things for example the privacy protection related things the apps are still in the old ui the privacy protection option is old is in old ui battery and performance which is actually changed and it's updated now but in this this is not updated at all Talking about the camera related things, the camera doesn't include any kind of extra specific features. The features are actually same here and if you're seeing the camera is not working, I will tell you why it's not showing here anything. In the camera settings, as you can see, watermark, etc. The features which you get in the stock, MIUI are present there. No extra changes. It's official update. It's not kind of a custom room else like that. It's official custom room, official update actually. And as you can see, we have these options and 64 megapixel, etc. Short video, but no new menu options are present there. Unfortunately, that was a quite good thing. And this was the reason why this the camera 
was not able to open very good cover you can buy it link is in the description this is all for this video i hope you like this goodbye over the edge feel like i'm floating through the air